How's it hanging dudes? My name is Sean and welcome back to another Jurassic World Evolution video and oh my god I'm like 24 hours late for this but uh, Isla Takano uh, revealed it's it's there in full force and there's so much to talk about and we're going to but if you love Jurassic World Evolution go ahead and smack a like comment down below what your ideas are about this island Make sure you subscribe if you're first time to the channel and smack that notification bell because you don't want to miss the sweet, sweet, sweet Jurassic World Evolution content that's coming. Am I right? Okay, okay I'm too excited. There's another thing that I want to discuss, but first, let's go ahead and just play this snippet 100% through for you without my commentary, just so you can kind of, you know, get a, a, the gist of it yourself. Alright, so there, there you go. Now you can kind of see firsthand without me, you know, uh, without my voice, my garbled voice <laughs> just kind of talking over it. But, oh, this confirms so much that I've been talking about. So, 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 so much, so much. Alright, so, first of all, there's, there's uh, Isla Ticano. Um, look at the scenery. The scenery is beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. And that kind of blows my um, build size limit out of the water. Uh, because if, if you know, the build size, probably, build size is probably a little more expandable. If you can build on every inch of this island, that would be spectacular. I mean, there's just so much to discuss here. Just everything. Like, there's actually, you can tell that there's different foliage. And I don't know with you when you have, like, the brush... Uh, the tree brush, if you uh, if it just pops up different trees automatically, or if you you know have a choice, I don't really don't really know, but you can definitely see different foliage, and that's really cool. You can see the shadows from the trees, like I know a little bit of details, but even the way the water tapers off from the ponds in the enclosures is in insane. But there, it, it even goes deeper than that. Before we get too deep in, though, I do want to say thanks to you guys who showed up uh, in the stream today. Uh, I surely do appreciate that. It's it's crazy to think that you know just eight to nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twenty people just show up whenever, just to watch whatever game I'm playing. Uh, that that's uh, that's crazy to me, and I appreciate you guys for it. But anyway, yeah. Uh, so you can see by the shots here that there is definitely a main street, which means it's going to be uh, kind of. I guess wanting you to build a main street uh, you know I mean because it's a, it is a theme park I mean it's a zoo but it's a theme park and even a zoo has a somewhat of a, a main street you know some sort of a you know corralling area for guests where the, all the shops and everything like that are focused into a center central you know small you know metropolitan little area where like the hotels and everything like that's at and you can see that here you can see the detail of the different shops the different colors like i, I was kind of um thinking that you know all the buildings kind of look kind of really too similar i said that in, like a video ago and it was like man i really wish there was like different skins for the buildings you know so and then you could see that there is definitely some color going on there's definitely some different buildings and if you look close you can kind of make out what some of these buildings are i want to save those for for different videos because there's a lot here to uh to unbox and if we discovered some good stuff uh within you know, this snippet of video we're definitely going to be doing that and uh also ign is uh was the first one to release some of this footage so credit to that uh that it's 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 mind-boggling really this like we've got to see a new island and it did not disappoint it really didn't you can see like the masses of uh of park guests kind of just like slowly walking around the exhibit and i don't know if like they're going to walk around to like a a viewing platform or something like that you don't really get to see too much of that but it's really cool and um, if you look in the far corner where the t-rexes are you can see that they circle and uh, they're in like this little fighting stance this little fighting pose and man is that killer like they don't do any attack animations which you know i, I guess it kind of sucks but no big deal i would i would also say though like the size of these enclosures like is that a small enclosure for a a very large 
carnivore don't they have like a certain amount of like hunting territory and stuff like that now of course this video is just going to be me shooting ideas and me talking about just general ideas about uh, the the footage we get to see here I, I'm just I'm just wondering you know a, a bunch of little things and we will unpack a lot of this different stuff in different videos but this is just going to be a, a garbled up mess of my ideas on what we see here and there is a lot to see in just a few seconds I mean even down to the music even the music is is oh man it's this is so beautiful it's, it really is this game is going to be a great game but well, like I was saying the enclosure size uh, oh eh, eh. you know because I'm envisioning like just like a larger enclosure I really am you you think about it I mean don't they have the hunting grounds you know like if you put too many t-rexes in one enclosure when they fight like we're seeing here and maybe that's what we're seeing is don't put them in you know don't put too many in one enclosure because they will fight and they will fight for food and if they don't have enough space um that might be what's happening here i, I don't really want to i don't really know and i want to i don't want to speculate that uh on too much but Definitely, definitely, definitely. That could be a potential here where they're kind of like, you know, fighting for space. There's only one or two feeders and there's two Tyrannosaur Tyrannosaurus in the same um, in the same paddock, in the same enclosure. So, you know, that could be what's happening here. And and then it would make sense if you have a smaller uh, enclosure because if you just have a small T-Rex or a T-Rex in a small or smaller enclosure, that would make sense because it's his own hunting ground. He doesn't have to have a huge territory. I, I, I can kind of get that, right? You see all the extra space on this island, which means there's going to be a lot to be able to do, hopefully, hopefully. So there's this all this extra space, and what I'm thinking is what I would like to do with the park, um, and I'm going to talk about this in a later video, but I really would like to have the majority of the park just one huge herbiv herbivorous enclosure, and you know have that like a gyrosphere attraction and you uh, can just go through the entire like 75 percent of the park let's say 70 percent of the park is nothing but herbivores enclosure and nice cool looking terrain and stuff like that and use a gyrosphere can just go around and kind of just look and, and see about all this kind of stuff um that's what i would like to see just a gigantic uh, gyrosphere enclosure where you can just go around and see all the herb 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 herbivorous dinosaurs sorry about that Anyway, yeah, that's what I would like to see, and I think they give you enough space like we're seeing here with all these mountains and nice, uh, all this water and terrain, I think we could probably pull that off, and then you can have like, you know, all the uh, carnivores as individual enclosures that you would have to see, you know, like up close and personal because they are so dangerous. That's kind of my thinking on it, right? That's what, I, what, I, what I'm kind of what I'm kind of getting at here. But yeah, down, I mean, down to the buildings, uh, the different colors of buildings. You can kind of, if you look really close, you can kind of make out what different things are. Now, of course, these are just some basic buildings. Hopefully, there's going to be a lot more once the game comes out uh, with and also DLC later at a later date. I'm sure there's going to be all kinds of different attractions and buildings and foods and restaurants and different stuff like that, which means you'll be able to really expand a huge main street and really make it kind of look like a Jurassic World Evolution or a Jurassic World um, you know so that's that'd be really kind of cool and hopefully like if you get to Isla Nublar that you'll just have that Main Street already built for you and you can just get to kind of tweak it that would be really cool but yeah guys I mean like Isla Tecano is that not cool I mean like we, we get a ton of new stuff and there's a lot to talk about and again we will be doing some more stuff in different videos um, with Isla Tecano but I really wanted to get this video out here and get it onto the channel for you guys. Uh, unfortunately, I was a little bit late just because I had to work real late last night. And I also had to uh, do a stream this morning. Because uh, we, we, we are a, a well over a thousand subscribers now. And you guys are just knocking it straight out of the park. So I, I had to do that stream. Uh, it was just a Far Cry stream. So it wasn't that big of a deal. But I, I like to do live streams for you guys every once in a while just because, you know, it's a way for us to both interact right then and there. You guys can answer me questions, even if we do just talk about Jurassic World Evolution. You know, it, it does not matter to me whatsoever. Uh, I really do thoroughly enjoy it. But don't forget, uh, credit to IGN for this. Um, we're definitely going to be breaking down uh, this little bit of footage further, and we're going to be extrapolating all the nice, nice little bitty details out of it. Um... So yeah, if you guys have any ideas, anything that you see that I haven't really, um, you know, talked about in this breakdown, uh, if there's anything that uh, kind of has gone, you know, under the rug, kind of missing, little hidden, that you know, little details, like off in the corners and little stuff like that, 
that uh, I will be kind of pouring over and doing a whole bunch of uh, digging into this little bit of footage. But if you guys see something before, make sure you hop on my Discord server and let me know. I won't, for I, I will never forgive you if you don't. So you better do that. You better do that. Hop in the comment section below if you find something. Please put it down there. You know I'm always there after every single video because you guys mean the world to me. Uh, we're killing this YouTube thing. We're doing the Jurassic World thing. This thing is 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 blowing up. You guys are killing it. Um, you know, I appreciate you guys like always and please 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 tune in for the next one and I'll see you next time